We are here today to talk about the endangered monarch. There's three things that are affecting the monarch population. Um, the deforestation of the overwintering sites in Mexico, also changes in climate, and um, the loss of habitat for the adult butterfly. The monarchs, when they travel up from Mexico north, they cross over areas um, where there's normally a lot of milkweed. Um, but since farmers have been using um, herbicide-ready corn, whenever they spray anything, they're spraying everything. So they're killing off all the weeds. So that includes milkweed, which is the host plant and a nectar source for the monarch butterfly. We're here today at the Holden Arboretum because the Pollinator Partnership has a terrific partnership with the Holden Arboretum in our newest project called Monarch Wings Across Ohio. Monarch Wings Across Ohio is a program to uh, research and understand uh, monarch habitat and we've partnered with the Calvin and Eleanor Smith Foundation, Smuckers, and a number of other partners across Ohio that have all taken a leadership role in monarch conservation. Pollinators are very important to, uh, to our health. One out of every three bites of our food is brought to you by a pollinator, and um, pollinators underpin the ecosystem services and natural resources that we depend on. People at home can plant native milkweed species. They can plant native nectaring plants, so the monarchs have something to eat throughout the growing season. They can use pesticides sparingly and also eat organically when possible. A homeowner can find more information by visiting the Holden Arboretum or going to our website, holdenarb.org.